Hello, and welcome to MMA Dogs and Locks. I'm BC Dave, and I'll be giving you all the stats and facts on UFC 65, Sanhagen versus Dillashaw. In this video, we're going to be concentrating on um, the number 32 ranked featherweight Darren the Damage Elkins versus uh, the number 44 ranked Derek with an A, Minner. Minner? Minner? With an A? Derek with an A? This is the tail of the tape. Let's go with uh, Darren Elkins first, coming in 26 9 and 0 against Derek's 26 11 and 0. Veterans, both of them. Uh, average fight time 12.05 for Darren, 6.15 for Derek. Um, I won't lie, Darren shows that he's had 35 fights and 12 minutes per fight. Uh, Looks like he's taken some damage over the years. Um, he does have a three-inch height advantage in this matchup, uh, and he will come in with a two-inch reach advantage as well. Uh, let's go into the striking. Uh, striking. Elkins, 3.50 per minute. Minner, 3.24. Striking accuracy, 38%. Heavy advantage for Derek on this one, 70%. Strike absorbs... Uh, absorb per minute, 3.08. Once again, heavy advantage for Derek on this one with a 1.40. Uh, defense, 52%. Uh, and Derek's at 43%. Once again, those stats are a little bit skewed. Uh, this is the big one that we're looking at. Um, three strike absorb per minute compared to the 1.4. Uh, in the grappling department, uh, takedown average per 15 minutes, 2.7. For uh, Darren, three for Derek, pretty much nullifies each other. Takedown accuracy, 33% compared to 62. Slight advantage for Derek. Takedown defense, 58 for Darren, 60% for Derek. Once again, pretty much nullified. Um, submission average per 15 minutes, 1.2. Now Derek in this category doubles him at 3.6. So um, I'm going to give the, the grappling advantage to Derek in this one. Um, as well as a slight lean into the striking as well with that striking accuracy of 70%. Uh, and the strike absorbs, that scares me for Darren. Uh, now, Darren is a veteran. He's taken a lot of punches. If you've seen his interviews, um, you can tell he's taken a lot of punches. Uh, he's an older gentleman who, has, uh, who shows the wares of being a professional fighter. Let's go to the records here. Um, Derek coming in 26 and 11, uh, 31 years old, ranked number 44, coming off a two fight win streak. Um, his last win uh, this year against Charles Rosa, previously to that, uh, TJ Laramie, both of which two decent fights. Um, he did lose to Grant Dawson in a rear naked choke in the second round. Uh, that was back in uh, 2020. If not, uh, he did win, uh, and that's the Dana White Contender Series. That's when he started off in 2019. Um, so pretty much just one loss in his UFC career so far. Uh, still doing really well. Um, I realize he's older. He's got a lot of losses in his background. Um, but ever since he came to the UFC, he's doing okay. Um, let's have a look at Darren. Darren Elkins. Now there's a now there's a picture for you, and that's pretty much how Darren looks after most fights. Uh, 25 and 9, 37 years old, looks 45. Um, he is coming off of a win, a, a rear naked choke in the third round, in a bloody fight against uh, Eduardo uh, Gregori. I can't speak tonight, uh, but previous to that, four straight losses. Um, this guy's winding down to the end of his career. I realize Derek is not much younger than he is, but he is still younger um, and in fight years, significantly younger. Um, I'm going to lean towards Derek in this fight. Uh, let's have a look at the odds. And here we go for the odds. You've got Darren Elkins. Uh, best odds we can find for him 
1.37. Looks like we're looking at about 1.30, 1.30. Yeah, 1.30 is going to be the one that we're going to be looking at. Uh, he started off at 1.30, and he's still at 1.30. Um, Derek uh, coming in at 1.55 on most sites, 1.65. Uh, 1.5 if you can get them in some places. Uh, let's have a look at what bit MGM. They started him off as a minus 1.35, and he's now in a minus 1.55. And I can understand that. Um, he is a favorite in this fight, and I do see him winning. Um, I don't know if he's going to have the volume to be able to knock this veteran out who has a chin. Um, yeah, I don't see him knocking him out. Uh, I'm going to take Derek in this fight. Derek with an A uh, in a decision. Um, Darren's just a tough mofo. And you're not going to be able to finish him unless you kill him. Um, he's a tough guy. So, yeah, Derek. Uh, in it, and uh, the decision is going to be uh, unanimous. Uh, that's my call. If you like the content... Please like and subscribe, leave a comment, and tune in next time for more stats and facts on MMA Dogs and Noise. Thanks for watching.